Hello, sweet world. Here I got another watch that I want to show you. Today we'll be looking at Sturmanski Ocean Stingray, a diver watch from Russia. This is not that popular brand. Um, maybe it is popular because it has some watches in the past that are significant in watch making history and uh, made watches popular like Sturmanski model that uh, went to space for example but nowadays uh, they are a little bit not that popular this watch uh, I don't know if this watch it, it will change it but for sure it is worth mentioning and uh, this watch is a diver type but with a very unique look um, to be honest uh, First of all, I have to say this is a big watch. Um, it's depending on the side. I uh, see measurement from 46 to 48 millimeters. It depends how you measure it. If I measure uh, exactly the bezel only, it was 47 millimeters without the crown and this crown guard here. So you have to keep in mind this is a big watch. But uh, thanks to placing the crown here it wears a little bit more comfortable than the size uh, could suggest and um, I like the positioning of the crown here because this is something different I like mix it up and see it in different places and here it it is well corresponding with the diver type of the watch uh, crown uh, this is not the crown itself this is kind of some kind of lid on the crown that you can uh, have to unscrew it and take it off and then you can set the time with the normal crown here underneath it and um, it could remind you of U-Boat uh, U-Boat watches because they are often using something like this on their watches here here's, it is nicely made it adds a little bit water resistance to the watch thanks to that at least I hope so it has a nice SAR logo on it and uh, maybe not everybody will like it but uh, it also corresponding well with the origin of the watch uh, watch is made uh, very nicely it's a little bit bulky but it uh, feel very solid uh, and and I have and I cannot complain uh, about it uh, if you're talking about the build quality um, of course the style isn't for everybody and probably even for many people will be too khaki and uh, too different I would say but if you're looking for something uh, to mix it up to uh, something different than usually have in your collection this could be a watch for you uh, this watch has a couple of interesting features, for example the dial, as you can see, it looks like a, a stingray leather surface, a little bit, also this this motif you have this here in the bezel, I don't think they use uh, genuine uh, stingray leather to do it, but uh, expression of it and how it looks could remind you of that and that's why the watch is called Ocean Stingray mm, it is interesting mm, I like it more on the dial for me for example on the bezel it could be a plane or I would prefer to see some ceramic here because this is probably not ceramic um, almost for sure because I don't have there is no information about it if there was ceramic here they will tell us about it so this is some kind of lubricant, metal covered with some kind of lubricant uh, as uh, very often for example Seiko did and doing still. Um, interesting feature of this watch is how the bezel work uh, because you, you, we are used to uh, whole bezel turning around with, in the diver watch and here you'd only turn this triangle on the top. I think this is a very interesting uh, feature of this watch probably besides the look of it uh, the most interesting feature and I like it a lot 
uh, as a watch collector I very often like to see something different in a watch and and this is one of the features that for sure is interesting and I overall personally like it and of course uh, all the markers here on the bezel this triangle and of course indexes are covered with super luminova so it glances in the the low light condition or no light condition very well and and I like it uh, about it. Uh, this watch features popular um, Seiko NH35 uh, movement, so nothing too fancy but uh, good reliable movement uh, with 45 hour power reserved. Um, it, this watch has 300 meter water resistant and uh, it weighs about 160 grams mm, price of the new one uh, differs from uh, 730 euro to 800 euro something like that for used one this you can probably find it a bit cheaper so for, for the value it is a good watch especially if you find it on the used market uh, but of course you have to like the styling uh, what I don't like about this watch is the strap strap is uh, too slim for such a big watch uh, this watch wa was wear uh, maybe a couple of times uh, but uh, strap already show signs of wear so it isn't the best quality also the buckle mm, quite cheap one with just a Sturmansky name on it I don't like it a lot almost uh, I don't like it at all I have to say but uh, if you buy it new for sure you will also get for example <coughs> this rubber strap and here you have significantly better quality buckle uh, better made and, and with better feel rubber strap is also okay so you can imagine how it will look on the rubber strap uh, you could also be something uh, to mix it up. I always like to have some more options with the watch. I want to show you one more thing um, the box of this watch because it's uh, wor worth mentioning because it's really nice. Uh, also, like a submarine type with this uh, window here, like in the submarine, and also the surface, uh, like with the stingray leather surface. I don't believe also here that they use a genuine stingray uh, leather but the, the imitation is quite good and I like this box uh, to be honest a lot. So if you, somebody want to put it on the shelf or this is your only watch this is some kind of nice item that you can use <laughs> in your house or something like that. Okay so that's probably it. Uh, Sturmajski Ocean Stingray. Thank you. Bye.